What's on? Hello there, and welcome as ever to Arts Word. I'm Fliss Goldsmith, you're our lovely listeners, and this is Arts Word Super 6. Arts at the Folly to start with. Now, I came across this gem of an event and I'm shoehorning it in to this week's Super 6 because I simply cannot bear the thought of anyone missing it. Arts at the Folly is on over the bank holiday weekend from the 24th to the 28th of May. It involves a group of local artists and artisans plus some guest artists putting on an exhibition covering everything from animal art, textile art, abstracts, portraits, jewellery, bags, glassware, pottery and even more. Plus, and here is the clincher, there will be a supply of refreshments and a glorious selection of cakes. So, they had a really successful year last year and are hoping to build on that this year, so please get yourself down to the folly. Now that's situated on the main road in Lovely Lee, which is a beautiful little village out near Matlock. The postcode for it is DE565 5GJ if you are going to sat nav your way there. So head on over to the Facebook page, Arts at the Folly, to find out more about this fantastic event. You will have a real treat of a day out. I will be going myself just to quality control the cake, obviously. Next, we're going to dive right into the Dovedale Arts Festival. The seventh Dovedale Arts Festival takes place at the Isaac Walton Hotel and that will be on from the 8th to the 10th of June. It's an energising cocktail of music, talks, walks and art with a strong focus on the locality. It will include the likes of novelist John McGregor, naturalist Mark Cocker, biographer Julian Glover and poets Helen Mort and Catherine Towers who all have a real connection with the Peak District. It'll be a wonderful weekend of creativity right in the heart of our Peak District. Smashing stuff. Now, we move on to a tale of somewhat epic proportions. In a cold, grey town not too far from here, hidden behind a crumbling wall with a thousand signs that say keep out, lives the selfish giant. So selfish that he shut away the garden where the children play and he cursed the town to a never ending winter. Well, also the story goes. But one curious child wants to discover what really lies within. Oscar Wilde's classic tale is reimagined for the stage in this magical adventure for the whole family and it's brought to you by Rongsomble. Rongsomble are a Yorkshire based theatre company famed for creating fantastic family theatre for all ages. Packed full of original music, puppetry, magic and adventure, the selfish giant promises to be a theatrical treat not to be missed. You can see it at Derby Theatre Studio on June the 9th. And how hard I worked on my diction not to bring you the shellfish giant, I can tell you, that is a totally different story. To Birdsong now. Birdsong comes to Derby Theatre marking the 100th anniversary of the end of the First World War. The hit, critically acclaimed stage show based on the world famous novel by Sebastian Falks. In pre-war France, a young Englishman, Stephen Raceford, embarks on a passionate and dangerous affair with the beautiful Isabella Zare, and it turns their world upside down. As the war breaks out over the idyll of their former life, Stephen must lead his men through the carnage of the Battle of the Somme and through the sprawling tunnels into the deep underground. Faced with the unprecedented horror of war, Stephen clings to the memory of Isabel and his world explodes around him. Following on from their national tours which ran from 2013 to 2015 and seen by over 200,000 people, now it's your chance to experience this stunning piece of theatre live on stage. Do not miss this mesmerising story of love and courage set to the background of the Great War. Birdsong can be seen at Derby Theatre from the 11th to the 16th of June and tickets are priced from £15.50. Ladies, gentlemen, 
children of all ages ever had that moment where you look in the mirror and think, gosh, I really need a haircut. It's getting a little bit out of hand. Well, here is a girl who can really relate to that. Rapunzel is at Sharp's Pottery Museum in Swaddlingcote on the 16th of June from 2 to 4 p.m. Chorus Theatre will return to present a new adaptation of this classic Grimm's fairy tale. It's going to feature songs, music, puppetry and tons of audience interaction, so it's perfect for all the family. There will be a themed craft session to follow and it's a simply bargainer's £5 per person. You will need to call them on 01283 222 600 to secure your place. Booking is essential as tickets will be here today, gone tomorrow. No, that's my brush with comedy done for today. Cue the tumbleweed. And for our finale. Furthest from the Sea are appearing on the 16th of June with over 100 performers and five stages dotted around Derby. There's so much happening on this one day, it would be hard for you not to find something to enjoy. There will be comedy, folk music, workshop, exhibitions, photography, pop music, plays and poetry. But you don't even have to wait until the 16th of June. There are events happening all the time from March and throughout the year. Details can be found at furthestfromthesea.co.uk. And that concludes our saunter down the lane of all things arts for this week. So until next time, whatever you do, make sure it's super. I'm Fliss Goldsmith for Arts Word Super 6. Derbyshire, Derbyshire, Derbyshire. Arts Word. Derbyshire. 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 Derb